woman feeding nearly a dozen deer on her property is going viral. It's really cute, but it's also caught the attention of Fish and Wildlife, and they are not thrilled. Camera 7 South Sound reporter Shelby Miller visited Heron Island to meet the woman behind the video. We've spotted deer all over Heron Island. People who live here say they love getting up close and personal with the wildlife, which is why one homeowner captured it on camera and shared it on Twitter. Chowing down on a table full of food. This video of nearly a dozen deer belly up to a buffet of barnyard feed is a big talker on Twitter. No one could be more surprised than Mary Cogut. I couldn't believe it because I have posted deer pictures and videos before and I would get four likes or something. This video has been viewed nearly a quarter of a million times. Mary lives on Heron Island, a small private Pierce County community. You can only get here by ferry. Once you're here, you see deer absolutely everywhere. It's just a real characteristic of this island. It's a wonderful place to live, and the deer are a big part of that. Mary feeds the deer daily. She even laid out food while we were there. Thanks to social media, she's no longer just attracting deer. The viral video caught fish and wildlife's attention. It's not a natural way for deer to behave, especially black-tailed deer. They're usually more dispersed on the landscape and forage as they go instead of being concentrated. Wildlife officials say it may seem harmless, but feeding wildlife can have negative effects. It can spread disease, draw in predators, and teach animals to rely on humans for survival. And that's another issue as well. Deer that are habituated have, have more of a potential to harm a person. In some states, it's even illegal. But Mary says on Heron Island, this is nothing new. I also tweeted back to Fish and Wildlife and invited them to contact me. I think that if they knew the details about this island and that it's really been a deer sanctuary for 61 years, they might want to temper their comments. Although some may discourage feeding the deer, Mary says she's been doing this for 30 years and she has no plans to stop anytime soon. Reporting on Heron Island, Shelby Miller, Cairo 7 News. New